the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLEA, in conjunction with the International Society of Substance, Youth prevention professionals have joined the rest of the country in celebrating this year's World Day against drug abuse and illicit drugs. Speaking on the theme, People First, Stop Stigma and Discrimination, Strengthen Prevention, the acting commander, NDLEA Enugu State, Peter Oga, wrote out some achievements of the agency in the state and country. In the past that 1,675 drug offenders have been brought to book. Among them, 35 veterans, and so far, 5,147 have ended their With over 6,402 tons of illicit drugs seized, some of the prohibited offenders have forfeited that they got a well in the government. The chairman of the occasion, Igwe Eric Wafo, described drug abuse as a menace ravaging the future of the teeming youth and advocated for sustained campaign against illicit substances. I feel that all of you are here today, not just to come and listen and go, but from what I've seen, I can see determination in all of you, not just to find this drug and get away, but to fight. The special guest of honor, Governor Peter Mba, represented by his deputy, Ifain Osai, extolled the efforts of NDLEA and promised government's partnership to achieve a drug abuse free Enugu. Well, I want to pray to support the Philippines government in partnership with all our partners to support NDLEA in creating a crime free society. The Governor of the United States, Peter Mba, is working hard in the efforts to reform our schools, to strengthen the capacity of our guidance and counselors in our schools. There were goodwill messages from sister security agencies. High point of the event was decoration of deputy governor, among others, as ambassadors of fight against drug abuse in the state. Naomi Jonathan, here at TV News, Enugu.